It finally started raining again here in the Pacific Northwest. And we got this sick ass bash bar to install today. Uh, you can bash into anything. So yeah, I've been super excited about this for such a long time and it finally came yesterday. And today is like, it's two days after we did the wing install. Yeah. And it's fucking classic Northwest. Dude, now I'm happy it's back. Yeah, it feels pretty good. But I'm gonna try to do a burnout in the 8.6 when we get this fitted up because the uh, nice and slick road here. So yeah, we're gonna have to go to Johnson's to get some bolts for this because we don't have OEM hardware. But this is where... <laughs> We were like, shit, how are we gonna get the bash bar in? Because the bolts are on the top and you can't really reach the top of the, the bolt holes on the, the frame rail. And DJ was like, pop the trunk. And I was like, nah, how are you supposed to get in from the trunk? And there's just these bash bar holes right here. So you just pop those things off and there's the holes. So that was probably pretty obvious, but we took a little while for us to figure it out. Oh, and this is a... Do you remember his name? No. We gotta find his box. We forgot to put this in the video yesterday, but this is a TVIS uh, unit module unit thing. thing. I think I think that's what it was. Yeah. It was. Uh, yeah. So thank you to the dude who sent us that. But I think we both have that on our cars already. But it was pretty cool that you actually sent us like a part. And also some dude from YouTube. I'll find out his name in a bit. But he's sending me a power steering pump and the ISR short shifter because he's a G. But yeah, we're gonna go to Johnson's right now, get some bolts for the bash bar, and then pull that bitch up. You wanna help me here? Pop open the trunk. There. Dude, our next our next video should be having dinner on DJ's bumper. <laughs> Suffer and suck a bash bar. TRD gas cap, dude, it's dope. Hey, what's up? We've made it to the land of opportunities, and there's a sick Dodge Raider parked out front. Oh yeah, I forgot we needed a bash bar. <laughs> I was walking away. Trade? Yeah, okay. Dude, it's like noon on a Saturday. This is prime time, Johnny's. You got it, you're good. Hello. Where the bolts at? Over there. You're in a giant maze of bolts. You're like, where the bolts at? So we've got two sets of bolts to find. We have this pitch and size and this pitch and size. Sorry, that wasn't focused. These are focused. All right, we actually got everything found, thanks to the help of this sweet lady here. Okay, and then you wanted to get the frames. Oh. All right, so we got all the nuts, thanks to that lady again. We got our nut, thanks to that lady. <laughs> yeah. All right, come on, let's go. Just paid $25 for nuts. For real? Yeah. That's nuts. <laughs> and bolts. Time to go get bashed out. We got our nuts, we got our bolts, we got our bar. All right, we're back from Johnson's Home and Garden Do It Center Town. <laughs> There's the bash bar. There's the car. And we got all the bolts we need. Actually, oh shit, we what? only have three. So we have we have three bolts actually because uh, the place only had three. And we plan to go get a fourth, but we forgot. Totally forgot. Um, thanks for letting us down, Johnsons. I think we're gonna have to revoke the sponsorship. Yeah. Deal. All right. So we also forgot to get washers, which are a must. Well, we didn't really know that we needed them. Yeah. Jam it in there. Check it. Yeah. So basically, oh fuck, let me shine a light. Um, you really can't see it, but hole is just, just barely smaller than the top of the nut or not top of the bolt. All right. So it turns out the bolts we bought we can actually not use at all. So I'm gonna take those back at some point so I can get my $25 back. Yeah, that's a lot of money. But uh, yeah, we're gonna go to the auto shop here in town where we should have went in the first place, but we didn't and see if they got the shit we need. All right, we just got back from the auto shop in Black Diamond. We went there instead of Johnson's and uh, 
We kind of got some bolts that might fit. We're not really sure. We searched the OEM bolts for the for the 86 bumper and we figured it out and found out what the actual OEM bol bolts were. And that's what this calls for. The people at Street Faction said, use the OEM bolts and you should be good. But they kind of just don't fit and we think it might be because the the like powder coating and the overspray or the over weld, is that what he said? Well, weld splatter. Weld spl yeah, there's whatever. But uh so the o the OEM bolts that we the specs that we found online just like five times too long so then we had to go get shorter bolts and when you when we found the shorter bolts they uh like half of them just didn't fit the thread so i don't know it's weird yeah but yeah so that's our theory is powder coat and shit so we got one bolt in just to hold it in place it's looking sick man we also don't know if these guys are supposed to go on top of this little flange on bottom uh so we're just kind of winging it i don't know there's not even like pictures on their website of one of these installed so we have nothing to go by it's like there's not even enough room so we bought a tap well quentin bought a tap to clean the shit out of these threads but honestly just running the bolt through it is uh doing the job so all we really needed to do was just have some power behind what we were doing. Yeah, because we're running, running all that shit through by hand. Just We're not tough enough, you know? So confidence uh, reacquired. So uh, we got it kind of mocked up and shit bolted in. Yeah, it looks dope. Uh, we're pretty sure that these tabs go underneath here. Uh, and sit on top like we had them. Uh, the bolts were a little off, but we're hopeful that once we uh, adjust that, it, it should, should fix the alignment, make it better. Just chilling on some oil out here. No big deal, don't worry about it. Some guy sent us a Snapchat on the Morse Kids Snapchat, and it was just a video of him pissing all over a public bathroom. Yeah, just all over everything. Toilet paper, handrails, <laughs> the toilet itself, the So if floor. that was you, I would like you to come forward and be publicly shamed. Although it was pretty badass. It was funny as fuck. We're real fucking close. The bolts are all lined up. This last one is just hardly... Just barely off. Yeah. We're trying to work it on out. Twist and shout. Dicks out. So Quentin's trying to take out the rearmost bolt because the frontmost bolt wouldn't fit in. So he's trying to either take it out, loosen it up enough to kind of wiggle it so that both of them align, or we're just trying, trying whatever, you know. All right, so it's come down to it. Quint's getting the drill. So this is gonna be a tough one because it's we got basically two layers of sheet metal to go through. Just keep on keeping on. Well, Quint's over there doing real work. Figured I'd show off a sick new stick. Mogi from Initial D. Get these at uh, Import Bible. Pretty sick. Just Google Import Bible, you know. Be a cool guy. Pretty cool stuff over there, I guess. I don't know. Don't know anything about the dude who runs it or anything like that. Don't know. I don't know. I don't even know all the stuff they sell. So, they might be cool. They might be shit. But that's a really, really... The sticker itself is super, super nice vinyl. And the print is really good. Quint's shit hat. Quint, justify your hat. I worked for four months landscaping in it. Makes sense. So, I don't know, yeah, you can kind of see. We're gonna have to grind this hole out a little tiny bit just to make that fit. Yeah, that drill bit wasn't quite cutting it. Yeah. We need some uh, big boy shit. And then uh, I'm going to post, I'm gonna send this video to Street Faction because they like to look at like reviews of their products and stuff. And I just want you guys to let me know like what I'm supposed to do with this. Because all the bolt holes are lined up and this doesn't even like begin to line up where it should yeah that's like straight like a whole inch off yeah um but you know these parts are for old cars and whose bodies may exactly. flex flex like this, on it. this bitch could have been in an accident or something and we don't I'm know not, about it i'm not bagging on street faction at all this thing is beautifully built like look at these welds and everything is just amazing and i can't think of thank them enough but just let me know if you guys have any ideas about this and i'll be sure to try it out if the, not i might just cut this shit off yeah honestly the um but for now just gonna leave it like that yeah it's all bolted up ish roughly we're just missing one bolt and that'll get fixed so it's looking cool so uh we got all the trunk all cleaned up and everything and uh, all the loose shit put away we're just gonna test out this bash bar real quick yeah we're just gonna give it a quick test to Rooney. dude uh don't warm it up for extra smoke all right so Quentin got uh, jealous of my sick burnout at the end of the last video, which if you didn't see it, go back to our last video and uh, watch right after the uh, the end. So uh, he's go he's gonna do one for us. Yo, you don't have reverse. 
reverse lights either. Yeah, yeah, she looks sexy. Oh, That's a sick channel, Dougs. Well, she warms up. We're talking to a buddy down the road. I don't know why I'm filming this. <laughs> uh, these right here? Those are a while ago. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. That ought to keep you out of the trailer. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's kind of idling fast, isn't it? Really fast, yeah. yeah. Uh, while I got you here, I'm going to use you. Come here. So I just need to get it out. We're just gonna slide it up underneath the car here right quick. Yep. Okay. Great. There you go. Just source it for him. Huh? Did you rebuild that or did you just source it no, for him? No, I sourced it and then I rebuilt all the brakes. Got everything working. It's ready to go. Ready to go in the car. Yeah, here, I'll give it a sick shot. Now I just gotta uh Car trailer. Did the idle pick back up? It sounds like it. You absolutely can't see him, but right there, there is a Quinton doing a million point turnaround, and it's the funniest shit. Go. Oh. Smokey Robinson, dude. Brand new tires. Yeah, I know. Some very nice, expensive tires. Good thing it's rainy. Yeah. All right, so that was awesome. I, I'm like shaking. That was like the most I've hammered down on it. Yeah, that's pretty sick. I hit rev limiter on mm -hmm. the first one, I think. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, now we're gonna do something we've been meaning to do for a while to DJ's car. Thanks to a subscriber. Yeah. Yeah. Someone sent us this a long time. Oh shit. You got a little baby Scroogey? Nah. We need either a baby Scroogey or a Reggie Scroogey. Trying to find that baby Scroogey. Oh my god, look at that ass though. Alright, found the baby Scroogey. Uh, Doesn't work. work. It's too baby. I need something bigger. <gasps> that perfect baby Scroogey. Alright. Yeah, so uh, thanks to whoever sent this a uh, while back. Yeah, we forgot your name. Yeah, but we featured this in a video when we uh, got it. So thanks to that dude. Sick dude, I guess. Yeah, too, super sick, dude. Um, so we're gonna hang this babe. And I ain't about that hanging it outside deal. Cause it would look like shit. Unless to me. he gets like, lower. Yeah. Dude, I don't think there's gonna be a single sticker in this episode. <gasps> it's wild. Well, I did talk about my Mogi sticker. Oh, so but we didn't put any on. Yeah. Ah, uh, chint. Chint. How's it mounted in yours? Oh yeah, yours is softy. Spin it, just. Yeah. Exactly. That's what I was gonna do. Oh, I can even, it's so stiff. And you can move wherever you want. Yeah, dude. I just want it up there. <laughs> I move it out of the way, you know, keep it back here. Oh, no, now it's in the way again. Oh, shit. Sick. Dude, you should just put Mogi's face in the middle of it. Oh, yeah, dude. I'll order another one. Yeah, dude, now it's an import. Damn, I can't get over how nice that looks. Dude, remember when I was telling you not to buy this car? Yeah. I don't. Just forget it. Alright, that's gonna do it for this video. Hope mm -hmm. you guys like the skids. Yeah, we didn't really finish the bash bar. We're kinda just gonna see what we can do about this. Gonna talk to Street Faction. Yeah, I think it looks good anyways. And we know for sure that we'll be able to bore that bore that hole out in the frame rail and we'll be able to get that other bolt in there. So thanks again for watching guys. And uh one of these days 
we'll get my brake pads done. Oh yeah, we were gonna do that today, but we, we, we were gonna do that every day we've <laughs> ever filmed for the last yeah. two weeks. It's so. just such a tedious job. I know. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if like which type of like piston I have in the brakes. I don't know if it's like the twisty kind or the pushy back any mm -hmm. kind. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you in the next one.